Bray Studios is an extremely valuable cornerstone in the early history of animation industry. It was not Hannah and Barbara who discovered assembly line animation. J.R. Bray preceded them by 40 years. John Randolph Bray was the founder of Bray Studios, one of the first studios dedicated to animation. The history of animated cartoons as a practical form of entertainment really dates from Bray's first cartoon, The Artist's Dream, also known as The Dashin and the Sausage, which was released in June 1913. The Bray Studios additionally pioneered background printing, cell animation, and a first attempt at color animation. Many prominent figures in the animation industry got their start at Bray Studio. Max Fleischer of Betty Boop fame. Walter Lance of Woody Woodpecker fame. Paul Terry of Mighty Mouse fame. And many others were a part of the crew at Bray Studios. Colonel He's a Liar Comics series was credited to Bray himself. Bray's Colonel He's a Liar in Africa was the second animated character in history around whom a series was created and was actually remembered in the early 1930s as the Mickey Mouse of his day. The dwarf-sized colonel was loosely based on U.S. President Theodore Roosevelt, who was a known wildlife explorer at the time. Many of the famous cartoon characters of the mid-20th century were indeed merely descendants of experimental films produced at the Bray Studios. Thank you. 